Hello guys, this is Fu from Foxtech. People require us to offer a camera with even bigger zoom that they can see things, they can see an object over an even longer distance. Before we have the seeker 10, 10 times optical zooming, seeker 18, 18 times zooming, and now we can see here, this is the seeker 30, the 30 optical zooming camera right here. Okay, Seeker 30 is not only like an optical camera that has uh, 30 times zooming, and also it has many new features. Let me show you one by one. Okay, so let's start from the gimbal itself. Gimbal is made of aluminum, very light, very strong, and if you want to use them, just add, this is a two damper plate, and you can mount it right here, because you can see, if you in detail, we have many holes designed here, so uh, it can support any uh, loading bars with any position right here, so you can move them uh, from left to right. And then you can see we have uh, all in all 12 damper balls, very soft one. So by mounting them, you can remove any jello, any vibration from your image. It's very nice. The new camera has a 40 mega and also can offer 1080p 60 fps output and also 1080p 30 fps video stored in the mini SD card on this very integrated controller box right here. The whole, whole, whole gimbal is driven by three very powerful and very precise brushless motors, one, two, and three. And each motor has a built-in encoder to offer you the best precision. And also the precision on this gimbal is 0.02 degree. Uh, this is very high precision, so you can lock an object over a very long distance with a high zoom value. Okay, so, and also this camera has a very great feature that is the, we have never seen before. This is WDR function. WDR meaning wide dynamic range. And you can see, for example, you can see a dark object uh, with the surrounding it's very light, it's very bright environment, and or, or you can see a very bright object with very dark surrounding of, uh, surrounding environment. So it can help you to see and to find an object in any environment. So it's a quite useful feature. So the camera is controlled, and the gimbal is controlled through this very integrated controller box. Let me show you in detail. You can see all wires are very nice wires coming out from the gimbal and the camera into this very integrated uh, port right here. And then we can see here is the power supply port. It supports the 3S and the 3S to 6S LiPo battery. So that means 12 volts to 25 volts, very high voltage range. And well, we can see here an HDMI output. Uh, if you have a HD video link like DJI Lightbridge, Lightbridge 2, or the DVL1 on our site, or the Insight SE, you can still use this port. You can link HDMI port and with a wire to the transmitter, so you can directly see the HD video in your ground station. Okay, let's see from this side. We have the S bus, meaning if you have an S bus receiver, you can control all the gimbal, all the camera functions with only one wire to your receiver, and you can control all the functions on the radio. And here we can see roll pitch, your mode, zoom, focus, fix, uh, picture, and recording, multifunctions, and AV. Uh, for example, um, you can see AV wire is, is uh, linked so we can directly see image on this small monitor. Well, uh, for the RX and the TX, you can control this gimbal and the camera with serial port. Uh, that means you can directly use a data link. So if you use a PSOC, you can, you can know that. Uh, you use the data link and you can use the joystick, so it's possible to control the this gimbal and the camera directly on the in the ground station or on the software, we can control the gimbal. So um, let's go on and uh, see other features of this camera. Well, um, other features may including 
the mode for the speed control, you can uh, switch to fast moving speed, slow moving speed, and a very slow moving speed. So if because it's a 30, it has 30 times optical zooming, if you put it to 30 times, and it's very hard to track an object if it's moving and if you have a very fast control. So you can switch to very slow control to get a very smooth moving to the gimbal. Let me show you one. It's, um, you can see um, the control speed is very slow, it's that slow. So in that case, you can control, you can see an object over distance and you can track it. Okay, for object tra tracking, I want to mention, if you want to track an object automatically with this camera and the gimbal, now we will later supply an add-on equipment so you can directly uh, put it to the multipod right here and then you have the ability to track an object, even if it's moving, automatically. Uh, you can use a red cross in the middle of your image to lock on the object. So push a button or push a switch, and the camera and the gimbal can directly lock the target. It's very convenient, like many reliable things. Okay, this uh, so far about uh, the structure and all the features about this gimbal and the camera. And later I can show you how to control all the functions with one radio right here. Uh, imagine you have a pilot and a cameraman, and now today I will be the cameraman to control all the functions, to show you all the functions like zoom, uh, like the pan and tilt, and also other features. Okay, now I'm going to control the gimbal with my radio. You can see how it's moving. This is the pan controlling. And this is tilt controlling. The pan angle can go from 150 degrees to 150 degrees minus zero. And for the tilt, the tilt angle is from 90 degrees to 90 degrees upward. That's right. And if you want to zoom in, yeah, here is I am showing the zoom in. And if you want to track an object over distance, and you don't want to lose it, you can put the speed mode to very precise but very slow, so you can control and track an object with very slow moving speed. Put it back to normal, the gimbal can return to zero position. So, if you want to take a video, there is a switch we assigned and put it upward. The video recording started and put it back to the middle and put it on again. Uh, it's turning to standby, and if you want to take a snapshot, just Put it back and push it backward. And push it backward again. So I take a snapshot in this way. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to control the gimbal camera, the secret study with the radio. This is the AT9 from Radio Link. Um, I can control the, this is pan, control the tilt. And the pan degree is 150 degrees to the right and 150 degrees to the right. And the tilt degree is 10 is 90 degrees upward and 90 degrees downward. It's uh, like 180 degrees for the pitch axis. And if you want to use the zoom feature, uh, I'll show you how. Um, you want to zoom in. Zoom out. You can show the zoom feature outdoors case uh, indoor we have limited space. Okay, so if you want to control the speed, we have a speed mode right here. This is the fastest speed, and I can put it to middle. You can find the moving speed is slower, and put it upward. To the upper position of the switch, you can find the moving speed is actually very, very slow. It helps you to track and lock object over distance.
Okay, now I'm going to show you how to start recording and take a snapshot. Uh, if you want to take a video, record a video, uh, we assign a three stage switch right here. Put the switch upward. You can start recording and put it back to the middle and put it upward again. The camera is then enter the standby. And also, if you want to take a snapshot, push this um, switch downward to the lower position and put it back to the middle and switch it again you can take snapshot in this way okay guys this is so much about our new 30 times optical zooming camera and this is the Foxtech Seeker 30 and I hope you like it and use it on your drone if you want to see something which over a very very large distance and it will be quite helpful and also, if you like this one, you can find it on foxtechappy.com right now. And also, remember, we can offer the target auto-tracking add-on equipment for this one. And just wait within like two minutes so you can get it. Okay, so much for today. And if you like our product, Facebook and YouTube, please don't forget to subscribe us. And this is Fu from Foxtech. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.